Hi everybody, Devin here from Let's Head Out. Um, we are outside of Pigeon Forge and uh, we're going to do the uh, Bushes Baked Beans uh, Welcome Center. So, uh, Visitor Center. Sorry, not Welcome Center, Visitor Center. So anyways, yeah, let's, let's head out. Bush's Best Family Cafe. Uh, we're gonna, I think we're gonna try to eat here. Um, it's only 10 11, so uh, it'll be a little early for lunch, but we'll see how long it takes. And there's a Bush baked bean truck and some little selfie spots where you can uh, take a picture with uh, the Bush guy and his dog. So this is the start of the video. To take care of the daughter in law and the baby. Together, AJ and Sally raised four boys. Fred, Long, Alex, Frank, Charlie, and Lisa. We lived in a family home until about 1909. It's actually still standing right across the street from where you are now. The mall is an extension of AJ and Sally's heart for the sake of their children. It provides time to run for a childhood and all the and more than all right, so uh, we were told that um, the narration and stuff on all the videos is actually um, the Bush family that narrates all the videos and stuff. So it was, I guess, all their grandkids. That was Granddaddy's heart. And in later years, when he was not able to go to the store or not able to go and stay all the time, anytime somebody went to the store and came back, he would want to know how are they trading. There's that family. AJ saw the story more than beginnings. He saw it as an opportunity to care for his community and his family. This is a pretty cool place, huh, Helen? Mm -hmm. all the stuff about the Bush's business. All the old Bush baked beans truck. This is the little section about the secret family recipe. That that to start, and it happened to be baked beans, and it happened to work. The determination happened to be that is there an on awesome his side, and over time, it did work. Bush's best baked beans went to market in 1969. Check out that stove. Not only saw Paul likes the color. They soon became. After seven disappointing years, then they said they wanted him to come down here and be president. There's a big bean spoon. All right, we're gonna keep walking around. I guess, yeah, they was talking about how the war effort, they were needing tomatoes and stuff like that, so they started doing other things besides beans during the war. And even after, I guess, they they were doing turnip greens, yams, sauerkraut, hominy, navy beans, light kidney beans. Of course, I think they still do kidney beans. I don't know. This is going to date me, but I remember seeing these in my, in my granny's kitchen when I was growing up. <laughs> so apparently this is how much I weigh in beans. I have got to go on Hannah, diet. Get your food off. Hannah's stepping on it, making it go up. 
Actually, it went down. <laughs> did it go up? I wasn't paying attention. Hey, let me see what my weight is. It did go oh, up. Go ahead. <coughs> Mia's turn. Down, yeah, because I had three. Oh, get off that scale. Hey, it went up. <coughs> Put your step on it. <laughs> I had the first weight. Your turn, Hannah. Oh. Your turn. No. All right, mom's turn. Uh -oh. Hannah and mom weigh about the same. I mean, Amelia and mom. This is the golden pinto bean. We have different beans. Great Northern bean talks about the different kinds of beans. There's a pinto bean. Which means painted. That's why so they call paint horses pintos. Garbanzo beans. Look at all those garbanzo. Black beans, which are which are good beans. And then there's navy beans. <laughs> And then we're Did back to the kids. Did everybody see the 10-minute movie in the theater? Yeah. Really good. Yeah, if you didn't see it, you need to go back and see it. Because it tells you all about it. Uh, it tells you all about it. So how many beans does Bushes use in a day? Too many to count. So I don't know. I don't know. Dried beans. Literally, in fact, the amount of beans we use daily weighs nearly as much as five fully loaded 737 airplanes. Phew! That's a lot of beans. That's cool. So this is where they get most of their beans from. All their beans. Oh, sorry. Four. What do you think about that? I think that's pretty cool. There's a big bushes baked bean can right here. Can I stand beside it so we can get it full? Go around it. How big that can of baked beans is. Mm -hmm. Alright, we gotta find Duke in this puzzle. It's like where's where's Duke? I don't see Duke. There's Duke, right? There's Duke right there. Wait. And I guess they don't do nothing. Uh, we just found them. Same one. Yeah, same one. Yeah. So we found Duke. Alright, so these are all um, the different kinds of beans and peas and stuff that they sell. Gosh, I just got them opened all over. Um, they got chili and organic bushes beans. Which is right up our alley. So they have a. These are the new cans, the new kind of beans. They're organic. Oh, wow. Well. Those are the ones that are in testing? Yep. Yeah, they're. So these are all in testing. These aren't actually out on market. Little heads up. These are coming, baby. Do that Chipotle smoke mole. Mm -hmm. This one. Mm -hmm. That sounds good. We're kind of excited about these zesty black beans and organic bowl topper, which has got chickpeas and stuff. That sounds good too. Curried chickpeas. Hmm. That's awesome. Pretty cool. The girls are going to play a quick game of bean tic tac toe. What? Look at the concentration in Hannah's face. Uh oh, Mia's red, Hannah's black. Concentration. The concentration is building. Oh no, Mia, I know you just didn't. 
can't believe you. I can't believe you. Redo, redo. That was terrible. <laughs> She was not, she was thinking about her. She was like concentrating on. Right. Oh my goodness. Who went Go. first last time? You make it so quick, huh? There's no winner in that game. Okay, start over. Cat guy. One more game. Okay. You go first. <laughs> Yeah, cat's got Hannah's tongue. All right. All right, so we're gonna go on down this way. You let me win? No, I didn't. I won. I didn't mean it. It's 10:35. I think that's probably the first time. And that's the end of the museum. The restaurant opens up at 11, so we'll hang out till 11 and get us some lunch here. And uh. Watch the video. Thanks for coming to the home of all things beans. We hope you come back. Well, you're welcome. <laughs> all right. So we're gonna go into the little shop and check all this stuff out. What was the dog's name? Shrek. That means stuff. Uh, Duke. 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 So we might have to try this pinto <laughs> bean pie. Uh, I'm not really excited about trying the pinto bean pie, but we'll give it a shot and see. So they have a uh, penny press machine here, which is pretty cool. There's plenty of pennies. You just need quarters. I, I've tried, I've done these penny things on here before. You can't see them really good, but which one are you going to do? You going to do Duke? Yep. Or the old truck? Or the visitor center? Or the just the logo. Here's the penny. Put the light them up here. I got a green one right here. All right, so let's see which one we're gonna do. Well, that's loud. Let's do the dog and the truck. <laughs> gonna do the doggy. <laughs> Out it comes. You can't see it really good, but it's Duke. Let's see if I can make it. I don't know if it'll. Oh, see, I dropped it. Oh well. Anyways, it's uh, the Duke one, which is that one right there. It says, "Make me an offer." All right. All right, so we are gonna continue on in here. See what Hannah and Mia is doing. So yeah, they got bush shirts. They got bush shirts. They got all kinds of stuff. I think I might have to get a bush's baked bean shirt. Isn't this cool? It says nobody here but us chickens. Yeah, chickens are cool. They're also very mean. Look at this mom. Pecking animals. Oh, chicken. It's a little banks and all kinds of stuff. This is a neat little, neat little thing. All right, so we're back at the car. We're gonna put our stuff up before we go back in to um to uh. Look at the video. Yeah, we're gonna go back in and watch the video. I didn't want to put all that on the on the video, but then we're also gonna eat at the restaurant while we're here, and I'll do that too. But we got this. Mia got this sticker. Um, I've got a cooler that I put all my stickers on, so I'm going to stick that on the cooler. Uh, we just wanted to tell Zachary, our little Squatchy Vision buddy, happy birthday. Um, it's not, I think it's not too close to the end of this month or something like that, but um, anyways. Uh, we got him a birthday present, and uh, this video won't be out before we go to his birthday party, so 
um, we got him this t-shirt that you actually have to open with a can opener. That is, it's the coolest thing. It's the coolest thing I've ever seen. I, I don't, I don't even know what to say. I'm, I'm gonna have to probably go buy him a can opener to go with his Christmas, uh, his birthday present, so he can get to his shirt. <laughs> Which I'm sure they have a can opener, but I'm, I'm gonna get him one. Um, and I got this pretty cool looking shirt. It's, it's got uh, Bush's, Bush's Best Visitor Center on the front, and then on the back, it has uh, American Original. It has the truck and the. Merc merchandise store and and then it says it's in chestnut hill tennessee so that's kind of a cool shirt too so yeah i think uh hannah got the same shirt mia got the same shirt so we're all going to be matching so uh anyways all right so we are in the family cafe the bushes cafe bushes best family cafe <laughs> and uh <laughs> here's the menu Oh, they got southern fried bologna. <laughs> so, anyways, there's those. They look, Dad, they have catfish. Now this side has got uh, salads and then the sides. <laughs> Southern sweets and there is the uh, bushes pinto bean pecan pie that I'm gonna have to get and we'll try it out. All right, so we're gonna order and get our food and then we'll talk about it. So Hannah got bologna, bologna, bologna or bologna? I don't know what they want to I got the Reuben. And mom and dad got uh, hot dogs. You got the hot dog and you get the second hot dog for $2.99. And buy one hot dog, you get the second hot dog for two ninety nine. First hot dog, seven ninety nine. dollars <laughs> But it's got all the pictures. I got the chili cheese fries. Chili cheese fries. Alright, so just as soon as it comes, we'll, uh, we'll, um, go and get another tea. It's good tea. Yeah. All right. All right. So here is um, Amelia's chili cheese fries. They look amazing. So here are the uh, chili cheese dogs. Boy, those look good. And Mom got to go with her hot dog some uh, sweet potato fries. Hannah. Got the fried bologna, bologna, fried bologna. Um, can you pick up your, uh, let's show them how thick that bologna is. Look, look how thick that bologna is. Oh, that looks good. I should have got that. I got the Reuben, and that's what the inside of mine looks like. Mmm. All right, so we're going to eat it. All right, so Hannah just took a bite out of hers. You must see the look on her face. How is it? Pretty good. I think she likes it. Mia, huh? what do you think? It's good. Mm. All right, so this is the pinto bean pecan pie. Hell, you want to try it first? Hannah's, Hannah's, unsure, Hannah, Hannah's, Hannah's unsure about it. Yeah. Take your taste taste. Sniff it, just taste it. <laughs> Uh, 
Oh, she's going in for a second bite. Must be good. All right, my turn. Oh. All right, here we go. That's pretty good. It's not bad. Oh, you ready? It's different, but it's good. It's not a bad different. I'm not sure if I ate a bean or not. There's a bean in there. It's good. I never thought of putting beans on pie before. But it doesn't even taste like beans. It's good. There's a... Uh, there's a there's a little bit of a bean hint to it, just a real light bean. What do you think? That's pretty good. So we just made it out of the restaurant. I was really surprised at how good the restaurant actually was. Um, I like baked beans, anyways, especially bushes. Um, and I also like um, I also really like that pie. Um. The Reuben sandwich was really good. You, the sauerkraut was really good on it, and I'm in a shadow here. So, um, anyways, Hannah, what did you think about yours, your uh, sandwich? It was really good. It was delicious. That was the bologna. Could you taste the bologna well? Yes, and it was. I liked it. It was really, really good. Mia, your uh, French fries. It, oh, squatchies. That's almost forgot. I'm gonna give it. Eight out of ten squatches. Eight out of ten. So it wasn't as high as Paula Deen's. No, we Paula Deen's, at. it was delicious. So this is eight out of ten, so that's pretty good. Mia? Um, back there in the back? How many squatches for my chili cheese? Yeah, how many squatches? Uh, I guess nine. Nine? Yeah, they were really good. Yeah, I give my Reuben about 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 eight, I guess eight or nine. It was it was good. I mean, Dad, Mom, what about y'all's hot doggos. They were good. Chili, chili was good. That is awesome. The the sweet potato fries were good. Um, and I have to make a comment. You know, this is you know a good place. I mean, just period. Yeah. I yeah. think. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. All right. So that was our. Squatchy review. I guess it kind of rounded all up to about eight out of ten squatchies. Oh, mine was probably about um, probably about nine. Nine squatchies. So yeah, eight nine squatchies for this place. It's, it's a really neat place. Um, if you have the chance to come out, to you, you should really check them out. So, anyways, um, that wraps this video up. Thank you for watching. Um, if you're watching our channel, and haven't subscribed, please subscribe. It's the best way that I can ask to help support our channel. Um, if you like the video, please give us a big thumbs up. And uh, please ring the notification bell to be updated um, when we put out future videos. So, um, so yeah, that I guess that finishes it all up. So until next time, let's head out together. See ya.